much, everyone. All right, are you finding that as you get older, your flexibility isn't quite what it used to be? Well, our next guest is a self-taught contortionist who says that improving your range of motion is easier than you might think. She shares how-to videos with her over 8 million YouTube subscribers every week, and she's here with some tips on how we can improve our flexibility in 2024. Please welcome to the show, Anna McNulty. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. And you know, contortionist is such a specific skill set. So I'm curious, how did you yeah. even get into it? Well, thank you for having me. Mm -hmm. And basically, it didn't start with contortion. So I was a cheerleader, and in cheer, I was always a flyer. And you have to do different flexibility poses when you're flying, obviously. So mm -hmm. that's kind of how I got into stretching. Mm -hmm. And I found contortion on social media, actually, and I just wanted oh. to try the poses for fun. Wow, and I just kind look of at taught that. myself at so home. You, just for fun? <laughs> yeah, know how to do these poses. Like, it was just a fun hobby, you know? Well, that uh, just for fun hobby has led to you exploding in popularity. Mm. You were recently named YouTube's top Canadian creator. That's huge. But I'm yeah. curious, what does 14-year-old Anna think of what you've achieved already? That's a good question. I don't think I've ever been asked that before. 14-year-old me would definitely think it's so crazy because, like I said, it was just for fun. I literally started just making videos, like, after school, like, in my parents' basement, just doing it for fun, and then it's turned into what it is today. So oh, That's fantastic. It's, it's crazy, yeah. <laughs> All right, so you help people become more flexible every single day. So what's your advice for someone yeah. like me who's a little stiff, like, stiff like a piece of plywood stiff? <laughs> um, how can I improve my range of motion? You're probably not that stiff. <laughs> <laughs> but you're being nice, okay. <laughs> I would say the main thing is to make stretching a habit. So I find a lot of people, the biggest mistake with stretching is mm -hmm. that they'll stretch like a couple days and then they won't see an improvement and stop. So if you make it a habit every single day, even if it's just five to 10 minutes and basic stretches, you don't have to do anything extreme to start and just do it every single day. And then over time, you'll definitely see an improvement if you yeah, do that. It's a consistency. It's a consistency. It's not like an overnight thing. Okay. Uh, yes. well, let's find out how stiff Andrea is. Uh, let's yeah. move over here. We're going to, or you're going to, show us sort of three moves that can okay. slowly improve our flexibility. So what should we start with? How do we do this? Okay, these are like my go-to three stretches, stretches right? that yeah. I do every day. So oh. my favorite one is a lunge, because it's a great Oh, these feel stretch. good. Okay, we could do yeah, that so one. just stand. Yes, exactly, a regular lunge, okay. and you try to push your back leg as close to the ground as you can. Okay. And make sure this is not going like over top like this. You'll feel oh, more Make sure the knee is straight. Oh, so we're stretching yes. this guy. Yes. Uh, what do they call that? Exactly. Yeah. flexor. Mm -hmm. Why You're does it look so different hips? when you do She's it? Right <laughs> do you notice? This is right on the floor for her. Yeah. I've been doing it for a while, so like you guys are both doing really good, actually. Yeah, well, this yeah. Is so good. It, it's hard to feel that way when we're looking at you, and it's like, you're much closer to the floor than we are. Yeah, right. you can also so we should do both legs? Oh. <laughs> yeah, okay, both okay. legs is always good to keep it even. Okay. So do you guys feel this one in your hips? <laughs> we feel it everywhere. <laughs> okay, well this next one is yeah. gonna be more of a hamstring stretch. Okay. So it's called pike. It's called pike. pike. All right, show us how to okay. do this one. This is another great daily stretch. So anyone watching this, this is a good one to do every day. Toes so you pointed? Want, yes, okay. toes pointed to start with your legs straight. You don't want to bend them. And just try to reach for your oh, toes. Oh, this feels, yeah, yeah. And then you can go all the way down <laughs> if you can. So you want to yeah, keep your legs straight. Oh. And if you're I'm watching this, this and you don't feel a stretch okay. with your toes pointed, you can flex your feet and you'll feel even more of a stretch oh. in your hamstring. Oh, no, 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 yeah. those guys right there. If you flex your feet, how long do we have to do this, Anna? I recommend, like, if you're doing it daily, like 30 seconds or so. Hold this position for 30 seconds. Yeah, you can okay. even, like, start here and, like, slowly work your way yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, that's Every what day. I plan on Every doing. Day. Okay, what's the yeah. third stretch you got for us? The okay. third stretch is a back stretch. So you're gonna lay on your stomach like okay. this. Okay. And this one's called a seal stretch. I'm so really nervous. So beginners, you can just go on your elbows like this. Okay. Oh, this is doable. Yeah. That feels good. Yeah. Then to make it a little harder, you, you can go you can on your this. hands. And I like to go all the way back. <laughs> but you don't have to do that. in your back. Yeah, that's what we're thinking. Yeah. It's more like it. Okay, so now that we have warmed up, you're gonna show us some contortionist poses and we're gonna try to, our best to pull them okay. off. The first one is called a wall split. So yes. please show us how it's done first. You need a wall, here's a wall. This is like my favorite trick actually. I think you guys are gonna have fun trying this one. Well, uh, fun. <laughs> so you are go we? against a wall and do a split, but what I like to do that makes it a bit more unique 
is I like <laughs> to go all the way down. Like that. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. so yeah. All right, that looks great. So Jess, you're up first. Okay, yeah, you can try it. <laughs> okay. That's great. Let's, let's, let's do it. Jess on. Oh, yeah. 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 Come on, Jess. You can do it. Jess, you can do okay. it. Get that yeah. leg up there. I got okay, you. Okay, that's actually it. And then okay. you can put yes. The men? Okay. That's like a, for like first time? Yeah. That's yeah. not bad. Yeah, good job. That's really good. Okay. Yeah, that was awesome. not bad. Thanks a lot for your support. A very supportive person. Okay, you're also known for this next pose, and I love the name of it. It's called the needle. Can you show us how it's done? Okay, yeah. I love this one. Okay. So, there's two ways you can do this one. You can just, you know, <laughs> kick it up. I love the but for like the first jump. time. You might want to pull it up like this. Wow. Okay. All right, so let's start slowly. Okay, Andrea. Maybe no, no, let's, you let's support Andrea. Let's start support slowly. Her. All right, so I'm just taking my hand and holding onto yeah, the back. Yeah, so you just grab your leg foot. like that, and then for like a first time, you can just grab it bent oh, like Andrea, that. Oh, this is Yeah, cool. that's pretty good. Yeah. Good job. That's amazing. Yeah, that was that's awesome. Good. All right, look at me. Contortioning. All right, so we have time for one more, and it sounds very okay. painful. It's called the chest stand. Oh, yes, this one is more back flexibility. So okay. basically, you go on your knees, and then you just roll until you're bent in half. <laughs> So yeah. roll. Yes. So we're on to our knees first. To make it easier, you can like start kind of with your handstand, and then you just okay. try to like roll into it like that. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of a harder one. I feel like I'm gonna. I mean, it's a good try. That is incredible. I know. Yeah. I so you... that one it does take some more practice. I a will lot say. of practice. Yeah. Oh, Really good. Thank you, Anna. Especially like your wall split and your like needles pumps, those were really good. Look at us. Yes, look no, at us. Thank you, Anna. Thank you, Anna. I feel so stiff now. What a delight. No wonder you're Canada's biggest <laughs> content creator for YouTube. Yeah. You're amazing. Yeah. Thank you. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.